everybody, welcome to another tour review. I know, I've done a bunch of tour reviews in these last few days, but the reason why I'm doing them more is because they're kind of more easier. Um, I'm not saying that I'm going to be doing tour reviews forever. I am still doing stop motions. So, anyways, going to review. Here we have the Transformers War for Cybertron Trilogy Siege Hound. Now, this guy... Is really old. Uh, I think he came out in like the first wave of Siege. Um, yeah. And um, for my defections for this figure, is this piece, whenever I transform it, it just snaps off. So, yeah. Um, first thing I want to tell you to do, if you want to like and subscribe, do it. If you don't, it's okay. Anyway. So, let's get started with the review. He comes with three accessories, but I only have two here. Um, he came with a little, like, grenade that I use for Optimus' Matrix. For, like, Optimus and Hound versus Starscream in that video. That's the ma I use that as the Matrix. So, yeah. And we just get on with transforming him. Well, first we gotta see that damn box. Yeah, backs. Here we have some amazing box art. Here we have the Takara Tomy Transformers Generation. Transformers. Transformers Siege of Cybertron Trilogy. And Autobot Hounds. And then on the back here we have um figure art. Um Battle Masters, um whatever. Yeah, these are called Battle Masters. And then his Jeep mode, and then he's 14 steps. So, anyway, let's transform this cool dude. Let me just adjust the camera. Uh, there you go. So, anyway, let's get started. You want to fold up his. Well, not really. Anyway, so you want to take um, these out. And then, fl then flip out his feet. And then flip this up. And then unpeg these. And then fold these out. And then fold it up and make his feet. So here we have this side. And now for the other side in, this, well, this kind of comes off. So I like to put it at the um end. So, fold out his foot. Now, what you're going to want to do is take out them arms. Them beautiful arms. Flip his torso or front of the car down. Here, let me just kind of... There you go. And there you have the top half. Done, and we're pretty much already done with the 14 steps. And uh, you're going to want to flip that up and fold this in. And you got a fully transformed pound, which that transformation only took two minutes. Um, now i got to put back his foot, which I'm actually going to have to do off camera because this is... I need full eyes on that. Uh, and... Uh, boop. And bop. Here we have the Warfare Cybertron Siege Hound. And if you actually want, you can plug in his pistol to be his shoulder cannon from the show. Um, I, if you, yeah, I'm not gonna make this 10 minutes long. I'll make it kind of, I'm gonna make it kind of short. Um, and uh, you can, um, there's a bunch of pegs on him. One peg, there's like, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. There's like eight pegs on him where you can put um this gun or um his pistol. And he also has another peg over here which, which makes it nine and wait, can you even kinda can. And um if you want to, I did this in my Optimus and Optimus and Hound versus um Starscream, which 
I had I give him like a super gun, like he would hold it and shot Star Scream, and shot off his hand. Now let's take that off, cause pretty sure it limits articulation. Now let's get to the size comparisons. Here we have another Siege figure, Siege, um, or for Cyber or for Cybertron Springer. A triple changer which cannot transform because um i i fear that these pieces will have breakage and they kind of do like i can't even fold them or do anything and it takes like five hours to put back the arm so i don't really want to transform him and spend five hours trying to do that um next figure is my first tour review which is tremendously um taller than him because he's a deluxe class Optimus Prime. And then we get to my last toy review. Studio Series. Um, I was about to see how. Uh, Studio Series Long Haul. So anyway, let's get him out of the way and start with the articulation. So he has a ball jointed head, can look up that far and down that far. Um, this can move, or can move out that far. Can go full 360, bicep swivel, bend at the um, bend at the arm, and a wrist swivel, waist swivel. Legs can go, leg can go up that far, back that far, spread, um, hinge joint here, and a pivot, and no swivel at the knee. So that's pretty much it for the, his articulation, and that's the end of this toy review. Which I gave him a eight out of ten. He has not as good articulation, and you know his foot. <laughs> So, that's going to be the end of the video. Hope you guys enjoyed. Um, see you in the next one. Bye-bye.